Ta kumjus tak miki grabul mogo kachichu ita bodunga tong haitwam chichi jum lumpa nita poe tikitu dolpa da bongwaleo kachikun ita hodunga iking kuno ba mulera chikun runda di hodunga kun hanka bi Wana kun bez ching palamule Ta kum jus tak miki grabul mogo Kachichu ita bodunga Tolba bank wale runda di hodunga kun hanka bi Wana kun bez ching palamule Kachikun ita hodunga Ikin kuno pa Mucho shak pa khat Kiye no no nama pa ole rachikun Runda di hodonga kun hanka bi. Ta kum jus tak miki grabul mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tong hait wam jiji jum lumpa. Nita poe tikitu. Kachikun ita hodonga. Ikin kuno ba mulera chikun. How can I help? No, not bothering you. Not exactly. I've been thinking about what the Jedi Council said about the two of us. There is a bond between us. I do not dispute that. I can feel it, as I'm sure you can. The nature of that bond and its effect on our mission remain in question. Necessary, perhaps, but it is no guarantee of our success. I admit, I'm a little disturbed that such a bond could be possible in the first place. I saw your service records when you were transferred aboard the Ender Spire, but nothing beyond that. I know very little about you. I'd like to ask you some questions, given our relationship. Don't worry, these are simple questions. Nothing too intrusive. First, what kind of background do you have? Good. On which planet were you born? Excellent. Your current age is? Yes. Well, the truth is, I was studying how you responded to my questions. Your reactions helped me judge you. This was a test for me to learn more about your character. You were honest, which is good. And you treated this as a serious matter, which it is. This bond we share will shape both our destinies. It is not to be taken lightly. But I imagine you've had enough questions for a while. So many things have happened to you since Taurus. It's probably a lot for you to absorb. We can speak again later, after you've had time to think about all this. Lord Malak, the Star Forge is operating at 200% capacity, far beyond our expectations. I am more interested in the young Jedi Bastila and her battle meditation. Have you learned how she escaped the destruction of Taris? She was aided by Karth Onasi, a decorated war hero of the Republic and a legendary soldier. During the Mandalore Wars, he was honored many times for his bravery. 
You know this man? Yes, Lord Malak. He served under me when I still followed the Republic. You could say I was his mentor. Interesting. How did you acquire this information, Admiral? An eyewitness, Lord Malak. Kalo Nord, a bounty hunter, was there when Bastila and Karth escaped the planet. Apparently, they left him for dead. A Jedi and a war hero. It's a wonder you survived the encounter. I am hard to kill, Lord Malak. Kalo has agreed to help us capture the young Bastila for a very hefty fee, of course. But I assure you, he is well worth the price. His reputation as a bounty hunter is well earned. Her companions are nothing to me, Kalo. But I desire the young Jedi taken alive, if at all possible. Lord Malak, forgive me, there is something else. May we have a private audience away from the ears of the common soldiers? I trust you are not wasting my time, Admiral Karath. I promise you will be very interested in what Kalo has to tell you about Bastila's other companions, Lord Malak. has given us a, a vision, like the one we shared on Dantooine. Did you see it? Of course. You must have. The Force is strong with us both. Tatooine is known for little but blowing sand. I find it surprising that there would be a star map somewhere in its desolate wastes. Perhaps, though that would have been tens of thousands of years in the past. Now there's nothing but the howling emptiness of the Dune Sea. A star map would likely have to be within some kind of shelter to protect it against dust and sandstorms. I suspect there are many such caves and caverns hidden in the sands of the Dune Sea. The creatures of this world probably use them as their lairs. No doubt things will become more clear once we discover the star map's location.
Kipuna, bona na kichu. Selima wanga kun bikin. Mucha shaka panga. Mucha shaka panga. Kipuna, bona na... Kipuna, bona na ki... Selima wanga kun bikin. Welcome to Anchorhead, potential customer. Zerka Corporation stands ready to serve. After some formalities, of course. First, your ship is not on our list of planned arrivals for today. There is a docking fee of 100 credits because of this. That would be unfortunate. Zerka Corporation can't afford to extend credit. Everyone pays. That's the rule. I assure you that the fee is non-negotiable. We have a very thin margin of profit on this world. You know, I don't think you need to pay the fee. They'll let it go this time. This will cover any future landings as well. It's like a registration, so we can serve you better when you return. Now, as a customs officer, I can provide information on services. Is this visit business or pleasure? It depends on what level of risk you want to take. You could ask at the Zerka office if any bounties need collecting. That's in the central anchor head. While you're at the office, ask for a hunting license so you can sell trophies to Faza in his lodge, just north of them. I suppose you could also take up swoop racing. Talk to the hut at the registration office by the track. That's in West Anchorhead. I can't say I know which of these jobs is the most dangerous. I stay away from all of them. That's not much information. Could you tell me more? You a digger? I've heard of ruins being found now and then, but they've always been stripped by sand people soon after. You're not going to get anywhere with them. I guess you could ask around, but I doubt you'll learn anything different. You could always ask a Jawa. It's hard to tell what they know. As you wish. If you need anything else, I'll be here. Colo Luz 
Ivan Dufedan Elva, Mori Fidan Elva, Abuelta, Colo Duf Ivan Rebu. have anywhere else to turn. If you're down and out on Tatooine, you're on your own. My husband was a hunter, killed out on the dunes. This raid plate is all I have left. Please, will you buy it? I don't need a handout. I just can't sell it to Faza without a license. Please, I'm worried about having it. They're so rare. No? But you looked... I'm sorry, I, I thought you looked equipped like a hunter. Are you sure you're not going to be getting a license? I mean, you don't look like a farmer, and the only way to be allowed out of Anchorhead is to get a hunting license. Zerka Corporation sells them out of their office just south of here in the center of Anchorhead. That's where my husband got his. I think they charge 200 credits, but they've been known to make exceptions. Please, no one else will help. Will you buy it? I can't sell it myself. They are worth more than 500 credits. I... I don't know. How could I be sure you would come back? Are you sure you can't buy it? Please. I trust you. Take the plate and sell it. I will wait here for you. Was that really necessary? I hope you intend to keep your word if you act so forcefully with an innocent. I'll be here. Please don't take too long. I need the credits. Maybe we can get started again. Maybe. Something you want? I don't have a lot of time for talk, so please, make it quick. Uh, is there some kind of problem? I'm just doing my job. I don't want any trouble from you. Hey, why are you threatening me? I just repair the crawlers. It's not like I'm packing away the credits. I don't know. This. What are you trying to prove? The Force is not a thing to be trifled with. Continue to use it frivolously and you may find yourself straying down the dark path. I suppose I do like you. Here's a few creds. Is there something else? All right then, back to work, I guess. La boda ani when kiss my toma. Wanna call best Jingba ma rulira. Top Jingba non kick. Top ninja rulira ra best. Uba patu koji. Tong nong bong chong yung yang. Tong kotok smak delia. Kuyabi just kuna jitanai. Ina kunba ma rulira ra chikun. Slimo patona. Mundi ha donga chi hokabi. La boda ani when kiss my toma. Wanna call best Jingba ma rulira. Top Jingbang non kick. Top ninja rulira ra best. Can I help you? These are the offices of the Zerka Corporation. I trust you have business with the company. If this is about employment, I'm afraid all regular mining positions are full. And before you ask, we are also no longer selling hunting licenses. As I said, we are no longer selling them. There are too many people cavorting about outside the walls as it is. Well, normally we charge 200 credits, but I could make an exception if you agreed to perform a task for us. It's similar to hunting. The sand people are becoming a problem. They destroy our sand crawlers and kill our miners. One particular tribe is the worst. It's as if their chieftain has decided to wage war against us. I would like their attacks terminated. Bring me their gaffy sticks as proof. If you agree to do this, I'll give you a hunting license now and pay a bounty for each stick later. I'll give a bonus for the chieftains. Excellent. Now, just so we understand each other, this is an enforceable contract. Zerka Corporation takes this very seriously. Here's your license, and a few directions. 
We believe one of their enclaves is in the far south of the Dune Sea. You might try following one of our sand crawlers. They're regularly attacked. I wouldn't mind you escorting them. Very well, though I do have work to get back to. I assume that by out of the ordinary you're referring to the destruction of Terrace? That is all anyone is talking about. I'm afraid Zerga Corporation is not offering any comment on those events. We wouldn't wish to anger the participants. Farewell. Zerga Corporation welcomes your future inquiries. How can I help? I am confident that you can deal with that on your own. Tong Nong Bong Chang Nung Yang, Tong Kadok Smak Delia. 